Now, after you've worked on this non-destructive spot healing layer, that's the key. We're not destroying pixels. And if we make any mistakes, we can always turn this back on and adjust it. We can select things and make them um, go away so we can return to our original image. Working smart is the key to all of this. Now, the dodge and burn layer. How many times do I have to show you this before you guys get it? Create a new layer. Shift Option Command N if you like to learn shortcuts. Shift Delete brings up the Fill dialog box. Remember? Edit Fill. And we don't want the foreground color. We want 50% gray. Click OK. Change the blending mode to Overlay. Get a brush. Hit the letter B. Control and Option to control the size of our brush, the softness. We want a soft brush, fairly large, maybe not quite that large, and then low opacity painting. And then just coming in here, and I'm darkening up this area, clicking, pulling, and just darkening this up so we get a little more evenness in our dark area. This is not black. If we go to full size, you can see that, yeah, it's getting, well, it is kind of turning black. We're, and that's okay because this is where our text is going. But here is the real cool thing. Get the hand. See these mountains? Watch what this dodge and burn layer does to these mountains. It's going to darken it's not going to hit those, those white areas, but it's taking those dark areas and make them, making them a lot richer. There's a lot more contrast in here. And we can do the same thing right here. And remember, we're working non-destructively. If we mess up, if we take things too dark, well, we can always go back. We can change this. That is the beauty of working smart. Now, come out to full size. And what did we accomplish? Well, let's take a peek by turning this on, off, and on. Oh, my. Now, on the bottom most layer, to see where we were and where we've gotten, you hold down Option and then click on this eyeball. It turns off every other layer except for the one you're clicking on. There's our original image. There's our enhanced image. Tell me that is not an improvement when we lay the text on here. And I'll steal that text today. This tree needs to be darkened up a little bit. And we have this beautiful, high contrast image now that we can lay our text on. And maybe, maybe, the, the production company will choose your poster because you've taken the time to make it shine, to make it pop.